Oh, hi. You caught me putting on my lip gloss, which actually leads me into today's topic. If you wear red lipstick, you just may be eating insects. Because what do we do when we have lipstick on? We lick our lips or eat an apple and it gets all over the apple and then you're eating what's on the skin of the apple, which is your lipstick, which if it's red, you may be eating insects. Or do you have a fave cake, like maybe red velvet cake? Do you like strawberry frappuccino or ice cream? What about yogurt? What about red applesauce? All of these things, if they have a red coloring on them, could be made from insects. Lollipops, candy, um, you name it, if it's got a red coloring in it, it could be from, it's natural. <laughs> Insects are natural, right? So it's actually from an insect from Peru. And it is a source of income for many Peruvians. But is that what you want? I mean, it's a great coloring dye for clothing. It's very sustainable, but do you want to be eating insects? <laughs> it's interesting, even Starbucks used to use this coloring. It's called Carmine. And they used to have it in some of their iced coffee, their smoothies and their cakes. But back in 2012, different customers complained about it. And so they switched it up to using lycopene, which is a tomato-based extract. So there are other options and other sources for using them. You just have to look on the ingredients of the products that you're using to see what is in your product. So it's interesting. Um, I mean, you can even get it from berries, from beetroot, Burt's Bees uses Carmine. So if you're thinking, oh, I have a great product with Burt's Bees. I mean, I used to use Burt's Bees way back. I loved it. And then another company bought it out and it was no longer something that matched my, met my needs. But I just recently looked up their ingredients and sure enough, it contains Carmine. So I'm happy to say what I was just putting on does not contain carmine. And it does use synthetic iron oxides. But my research into that has said that the synthetic is more is safer than the natural iron oxides because your natural ones have heavy metals in them. And aren't we all trying to get rid of heavy metals out of our bodies, right? So thankfully, we don't need to be adding more to that. So just a little tip, um, check your ingredients. See if you're eating any of this insects, this carmine. <laughs> That's the color name. But it could be, I think it's color number four, there could be different names for it. And if you're following my blog, I'll be releasing the blog on Friday. And if you haven't been following my blog yet, I will post in the comments how you can subscribe to it. Now, go have a great day and go be awesome. <laughs>